This is the video to show you how to set up and use a Kaiser Boss VHS to DVD maker. Okay, we've got the DVD maker itself, all sexy and black. We've got these component cable, cable plug-in things, and external USB cable. Alright, I'm going to show you how to put it in to set it up. As we can see, I've got a laptop here to have it near the TV, and there's an AV cable which we can plug it into. Firstly, okay, the DVD maker itself and the cables for the audio vi video plugs. Then we have the bottom of the DVD maker, and we plug this into it. So, like that, you have to put it in firmly so it'll stay in. And then, if you want, I'm going to plug the USB cable in like that. Okay, so now I've got that. We can plug the USB cable into the laptop. Just like that. Now we take cables, plug them into the device. So it goes yellow on lit yellow. Make it make sure it goes in pretty far. Red on red and white on white. Just like that. And if you haven't already, install PowerDirector onto your computer, or you can just use Windows Movie Maker. Unfortunately, Windows Movie Maker has many frame drops, so I'm going to use PowerDirector. Yeah. Turn the TV on, because this is running, I've got my Wii running into the back of the TV, which is then running into the cable coming out of the back of the TV slot, AV slot, so picture on TV, turn on my Wii, then change it to the audio video channel, have your Wii plugged into, there's a Wii menu there, and now power director is loaded and we see there's a little thing saying capture. Click on that and it will load up the capture window. And there we have re menu on on the TV. See those little tabs where there has TV, microphone and like copying off a DVD. And yeah. So whatever comes up on the TV also comes up on the DVD maker. It also comes out of the PC speaker. And that's how you plug in and use Kaiser Bass VHS DVD maker.